Have you ever wondered why some people insist on climbing a mountain on New Year's Day? Well, it's either a New Year's resolution gone wrong, or they're in Tokyo, Japan, getting a unique start to the year. In Tokyo, the New Year is not just about popping champagne and counting down the seconds. It's about a journey, a spiritual and physical one, to the top of Mount Takao. This tradition of welcoming the New Year from the mountain's summit is one that is as enduring as it is challenging. Picture this. A first-timer, lured by the call of tradition, finds himself slipping and sliding on the snowy slopes. In a comical twist, he loses a shoe. But does that stop him? No way. He continues the climb, one shoe short, because tradition, right? But Tokyo isn't all about climbing mountains on New Year's Day. So, if you're not a fan of mountaineering, don't worry. Tokyo has many more New Year's traditions that won't require climbing gear. In Tokyo, counting down to the New Year isn't just a simple 10 to 1. It's a symphony of bells, noodles, and yes, you guessed it, more climbing. Now let's dive into the delightful chaos. First, there's the tradition of Joya no Kain, where temple bells ring 108 times. The number isn't arbitrary. It represents the 108 earthly desires that cause human suffering. Each ring symbolically purges a desire, cleansing your soul for the new year. But here's a plot twist. There's no automated system. Each ring is manually struck, making it a labor of love or perhaps a labor of purification. Next, we have the slurping of Toshikoshi Soba. Toshikoshi meaning year crossing is a warm bowl of buckwheat noodles slurped down on New Year's Eve. This tasty tradition is said to bring luck and longevity. But here's the kicker, it's a race against time. The noodles must be slurped before midnight or else the luck might just slip away. Imagine the frenzy of gobbling down noodles while listening for the temple bells. But wait, there's more. As if coordinating your slurps with the temple bells isn't enough, there's the climb to the temple for Hatsumode, the first shrine visit of the year. Imagine navigating through throngs of people, slurping your soba, dodging the bells, and climbing steep stairs. All this in the chilly winter night. It's not just a countdown, it's an adventure, a test of multitasking skills, and an exercise in charm and wit. Now, picture the whole scenario. The bell tolls echoing through the crisp air, the slurping of noodles, the huffing and puffing of climbing all under the starlit sky. It's a beautiful chaos, a medley of old traditions and modern hustle, a unique countdown that Tokyo proudly hosts. So if you ever find yourself in Tokyo on New Year's Eve, remember this golden rule? Time waits for no noodle, so slurp quickly, climb faster, and embrace the beautiful pandemonium that is New Year's Eve in Tokyo. Remember, in Tokyo, time waits for no noodle, so slurp quickly and climb faster. Scene script. Who needs a ball drop when you have a city that turns into a giant, glittering light show? Welcome to Tokyo's New Year Spectacular, where the city becomes a canvas of multicolored lights and fireworks, painting a breathtaking portrait of celebration. When the clock strikes midnight, Tokyo doesn't just welcome the new year. It embraces it with a dazzling explosion of color and sound that would make a supernova blush. Here, the new year is not just a passage of time, but a spectacle of visual delight. From the neon jungle of Shibuya to the historic Asakusa district, every corner of the city comes alive. Streets, buildings, and landmarks transform into glowing symbols of joy, hope, and renewal. It's almost as if Tokyo is competing with the sun to light up the sky. Imagine the entire city bathed in a symphony of lights with fireworks bursting in the sky, creating an unforgettable tableau. You'd think the city was trying to outshine the Milky Way. And just when you think it can't get any brighter, the grand finale kicks in. Fireworks of all shapes and sizes from traditional starbursts to intricate patterns illuminate the night sky creating a celestial masterpiece that leaves you speechless. And let's not forget the incredible light displays. Tokyo takes illumination to a whole new level. It's not just about the lights. It's about the creativity and the storytelling. Each light display tells a unique story, 
whether it's a tribute to the past, a celebration of the present, or a vision of the future. It's like watching a storybook come to life, with each page more enchanting than the last. But it's not just about the visual spectacle. The energy, the excitement, the collective anticipation and joy that fills the air, it's contagious. It's as if the entire city is pulsating with the heartbeat of the new year. So, if your idea of a New Year's celebration is a citywide light battle, Tokyo's got you covered. Ever thought of celebrating the new year by flying a kite? Well, in Tokyo, it's not as strange as it sounds. In fact, it's a centuries-old tradition known as takoaj, a charming way to ring in the new year. As the clock strikes 12, families across Tokyo head out to their local parks, kites in tow, ready to let their dreams and aspirations for the new year soar into the sky. It's a sight to behold, the sky painted with a myriad of colors, shapes and sizes, the air filled with joyous laughter and hopeful whispers. Now let's add a dash of humor to this beautiful tradition. Picture this. A family gathered in a bustling Tokyo park, their eyes sparkling with excitement. They've spent weeks crafting a beautiful, elaborate kite, a symbol of their hopes for the year ahead. As they release it into the sky, it takes off with a gust of wind, soaring higher and higher. But oh no, it's heading straight for another family's kite. There's a moment of panic, a flurry of activity. The strings tangle, the kites dance a chaotic waltz in the sky. And then, they both plummet to the ground. The park erupts in laughter, the mishap breaking the ice among strangers, leading to new friendships and shared memories. This amusing incident is a testament to the spirit of Takoaj, a tradition that's not just about flying kites, but also about community, camaraderie, and starting the new year with a sense of unity and shared joy. It's a gentle reminder that sometimes it's the unexpected twists and turns, the tangles and falls that make life's journey truly memorable. And isn't that what the new year is all about? Embracing new experiences, learning from our mishaps, and moving forward with a sense of humor and optimism. So, if you're a kite enthusiast, Tokyo's new year is the wind beneath your well, kite. So whether you're a mountain climber, a noodle slurper, a light chaser, or a kite flyer, Tokyo's New Year's celebration has something for everyone. As we wrap up this journey through the vibrant streets of Tokyo during New Year, it's clear to see that this city knows how to ring in the New Year with style, tradition, and a touch of humor. From the moment we found ourselves in the midst of that exciting bumpy start, Tokyo captivated us with its unique blend of modernity and tradition. And who could forget that adrenaline charge countdown to midnight? The anticipation, the excitement, the sheer joy of welcoming the new year was palpable in every corner of the city. Let's not forget the spectacular new year celebrations that Tokyo is renowned for. The city transforms into a magical wonderland with lights that captivate, music that uplifts, and the spirit of unity that warms every heart. It's a spectacle that truly encapsulates the essence of Tokyo's New Year's celebration, a blend of tradition, innovation, and an unabashed love for life. In this city, the New Year is not just about turning the page of a calendar, it's about embracing new experiences, from flying kites high in the crisp winter sky to slurping down a bowl of delicious noodles for good luck. It's about the shared laughter as we watch the humorous stories unfold, adding color and life to the celebrations. And it's about the unforgettable memories made with loved ones against the backdrop of Tokyo's stunning New Year's spectacle. But Tokyo's New Year's celebration isn't just about the grandeur and the lights. It's also about finding joy in the smallest of things. It's in the warmth of a shared meal, the thrill of a kite soaring high and the quiet peace found atop a mountain. It's a reminder that every new year brings with it the promise of new beginnings, new adventures, and new stories waiting to be written. As we usher in the new year, let's take a leaf out of Tokyo's book. Let's embrace the traditions that bind us, the humor that unites us, and the shared experiences that define us. Let's welcome the new year with open hearts, open minds, and a spirit of adventure. So here's to the new year. Here's to the laughter, the memories, and the shared experiences 
that make life worthwhile. Here's to the mountain climbers, the noodle slurpers, the light chasers, and the kite flyers. Here's to Tokyo, a city that knows how to welcome the new year with open arms and a heart full of joy. And remember, the best way to embrace a new year in Tokyo is with a sense of humor, an appetite for noodles, and a sturdy pair of climbing shoes.